DNA Star now offers several different gene panel workflows in the Laser Gene Genomics Suite. In this video, we'll discuss the paths and objectives of these different workflows. When doing gene panel workflows within our Laser Gene Genomics Suite, the first step is to evaluate whether you have control data. First, we'll look at the case of a gene panel data set without a control. Here, you load in your sample data and utilize both bed and VCF files to ultimately analyze variants specific to your sample. There are several additional gene panel workflows available when you are working with control data. The first example of this is our validation control workflow. The goal here is to run an assembly using Seekman Engine to verify that you are getting the SNPs that you know are there. So here you're validating your entire process, including sample prep, sequencing, and software by again incorporating VCF and bed or manifest files into your workflow, you can ultimately validate the overall specificity, sensitivity, and accuracy of your assembly and analyze these statistics in an ArrayStar report. In addition to running a validation control, you can also choose to pursue a Mendelian or germline gene panel assembly. Here, you utilize a control sample in addition to your experimental samples, along with VCF and bed or manifest files when setting up your assembly in Seekman Engine. Ultimately, you're able to analyze the sample-specific variants in ArrayStar. Finally, we offer workflows for cancer or somatic gene panel assembly. In this case, you would assemble data from both normal samples and tumor samples. In conjunction with VCF and bed or manifest files, you can identify both normal tissue variants as well as tumor tissue variants. By then subtracting the normal tissue variants from the tumor tissue variants, you can then ultimately identify tumor-specific variants. Explore our video library, as we will soon be launching new videos which take you step-by-step -step through each of these gene panel workflows. If you have any other questions about gene panel workflows, please visit our website at www.dnastar.com or contact us at support at dnastar.com.